Hi everyone. This is my Listo generator. Uh, it's actually a Listo engine with a Bakey B generator. And what I would like to show you guys now is how to adjust the voltage of the Bakey B generator. When I bought the machine, it was giving uh, a too low voltage, about 355 out of 380. So yeah, the voltage was much too low, and so I had to find a way how to inc I had to find a way to increase the voltage. So I looked a lot on the internet, but I couldn't find too much information about it. So I did more research. Uh, I did. I had some contact with some uh, experienced mechanics, and finally I got the answer: is that. Um, yeah, I got the answer about it, how to do it, and I would like to share your, you th that experience with you guys. First of all, uh, the whole generator is powered by a little three-cylinder engine. It's running really nicely. It's a TSA three. Um, yeah, really reliable engine. Uh, I bought, I, I built by myself an air cleaner on it. There's this one. It's uh, yeah. It's in this way it's pretty compact so yeah I'm really happy about that how that turned out um, yeah and but back to the generator it's a 16.25 uh, kVA generator BKB and yeah it has also it's a uh, older type it's uh, with brushes in, the, in there I already replaced the brushes, um, but yeah, still I have to find a way to how to increase the voltage. Down here we have the uh, regulator, um, but it seemed all pretty good, and also the the wiring inside seemed also pretty good. Um, so basically, but yeah, to increase the voltage. Um, there is actually in this whole regulator here, there is um, paper inside here, they, where they, it's actually a factory setting, and <clears throat> basically this, I had to uh, take the paper out here, a, f a few shims, out, uh, so uh, the, uh, the regulator um, was more active. active. It was, that was the uh, explanation by the, uh, uh, by the by the mechanic. I should m make it more active. <clears throat> so I took a few shims out, and after that, I, after that, I had to um, basically when I before this, I, I adjusted it. This clamp was down here, and. Uh, because my setting, I resetted this regulator here. The voltage was also in uh, b because what was happening is that in uh, stationary mode, the voltage was about 365. But then, <clears throat> but then, so it was like maybe 370. But also, so like the continuous one was also too low. But also the uh, the the the, the the, when it had to deliver power, that voltage was also much, is still much lower. So I had to increase the stationary voltage, but also I had to increase the voltage on load. So I did with this one, I increased the voltage on load, but in that case also, when I did that, the voltage, uh, the continuous voltage, was even going to drop more because of this adjustment so I had to increase the voltage on the stationary mode as well and for that one and for that reason I moved this clamp all the way down here but uh, it was even a, it wasn't even enough so I just took the wire off from this clamp and put it on here so it has now maximum voltage and now it's delivering about three three uh, 78 or something 378 so it's a two two voltage two voltage two volts difference 
So it's actually, and that is exactly the same in continuous mode or when it's delivering power. So now it's <coughs> now it's really ni running nicely, and I'm really happy with this modification. So that's that was that was it for for now, and I will probably make some more videos when it's running.